Welcome back Future Medicos. In today's video, we are going to look at a news that came very recently that there is an increase of 200 MBBS seats in Tamil Nadu. We already know that there are a lot of seats increased in Tamil Nadu this year for MBBS. And then very recently, as part of MCC round two, we have seen another 200 MBBS seats that has been added to the Tamil Nadu state. Okay. You will see which colleges has increased the seats and uh, how many seats has been increased in those colleges. So to start with, the first college we want to talk about is Sri Satya Sai Medical College and Research Institute, which is actually a medical college affiliated to the deemed university. And uh, if you look at the round one in MCC this year, they had only 150 MBBS seats. But if you look at now in round two, there are more than 150 MBBS seats. And if you check NMC website, now you can see that NMC has permitted this college to increase seats from 150 to 250 seats for this academic year. So the increase is 150 to 250 in Sri Satya Sai Medical College and Research Institute. The second college we want to talk about is SRM Medical College in Chennai, which is again a deemed university. This college also had only 150 MBBS seats last year. And even in the round one for MCC, they had only 150 MBBS seats. But if you check now in NMC website, they have clearly noted that this medical college has been permitted to increase seats from 150 to 250 from this academic year. So accordingly, these are the two medical colleges. Of course, uh, there may not be a direct benefit to Tamil Nadu students because it doesn't come under government medical college or private self-financing college. It Both the seats increase has come from deemed university. But predominantly, right, a lot of candidates in Tamil Nadu may prefer these two deemed universities. So that's why this may be a, a good news considering that many of you may be still trying to get a seat in deemed university. Okay, once again, anyone who is having even a very low mark, don't forget to fill deemed universities. If your score is very low, don't worry, go and fill the choices for deemed universities. I'm sure uh, still the cutoff in round two could be very close to uh, the lowest mark possible. Now let us see a summary of all the medical colleges in Tamil Nadu and what is the current status of uh, the number of seats in Tamil Nadu for MBBS. So government medical colleges, right now we have 37 government medical colleges that is including ESI KK Nagar. So which offers 5,175 seats, which is an increase of 1,500 seats compared to last year. The second category is the private self-financing medical colleges. We have uh, right now, we have 19 self-financing medical colleges, which offer totally 2,800 MBBS seats, which is an increase of 450 seats from last year. We also have one private university, which is Srinivasan Medical College Samayaburam, which is affiliated to Dhanalakshmi Srinivasan University. Of course, this college still has not started admission um, uh, there is some problem between the selection committee and the university. Uh, so the university actually has gone to high court and there is a case going on in high court uh, of Madras. Uh, I do not know exactly what is the current status of this case because I checked the last hearing happened on 16 February um, and the hearing has been adjourned. So I do not know what exactly is the current status, but I still believe uh, this particular medical college still will come uh, for admission in round two uh, in Tamil Nadu, right? That's what I believe. Uh, so this is one private university in Tamil Nadu. And then we have 12 deemed universities in Tamil Nadu. Last year, we had only 2000 seats. So we have an increase of 500 seats this year. And uh, from 2000, 
the total seats in deemed universities has increased to 2,500. Now, if you look at the total seats available in the state, uh, we had 10,625 MBBS seats from 69 medical colleges. This is an increase of 2,600 seats compared to last year. I do not know whether any state or even Tamil Nadu has ever seen such an increase in number of seats, but this year they have a phenomenal increase of number of seats. This is almost like compared to last year, uh, an increase of like 32, uh, 33 percentage of increase, right? One third of the seats has increased just in one year, right? So a huge number of seats. So I hope uh, the candidates will use all these increase in seats. Uh, and this is one reason the cutoff has not jumped up too much this year. Okay. Thank you very much. I will see you soon in some other video. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.